what up everybody it's time to go ahead and do our next ebay break we got uh what is this 2017 18 totally certified basketball eight box break number 17 ebay style so let's get to it yeah the heat game is uh definitely uh getting a little chippy which is fine by us we we, we like that good luck everybody all right ben simmons saucing on him though all right, let's see what we got. I believe there are eight boxes in this thing right here. Oh, uh, yes, sir. Let's go ahead and uh, open this stuff up here. It's a five-point game. Getting real close. Sixers have been shooting the hell out of that ball, though. We need to get down low, man. Get Whiteside involved. What are they doing? There we go. Let's go, boys. Do they have... Bam, I don't Whiteside's not playing right now. Man, what's up with Josh Richardson? Is he hurt or something? Joel B took the mask off. He just dropped it on the floor. What's up? You know you you about to not wear that thing or what? That little protective thingy that he had on it kind of fell. Bam out of bio with the slam a jammer. Yeah, I don't think Embiid is gonna. I don't think Embiid is gonna wear that mask anymore. Winslow's doing his thing, but you know what, man? It's it's really, really, really bothering me that Whiteside is pretty much non-existent right now. I don't know what the fuck is going on with that guy. Is he hurt? Like, is Embiid that much better than him? Like, I I don't. What the fuck? Uh, can I give you a deal on the six plus boxes of contenders draft? Uh, Ziggy, I mean, I can, I'll do a little something for you, but I can't do much, man. That's a new product, dude. That's a brand new product, and I got to be honest with you, man. I got to make my monies, man. That, and where the fuck have you been, Ziggy? I haven't seen you in a while, bro. Now let's open up these packs. See what we got. Where you been at, Zeke? Looking to hit some Barclays. Uh, are you? Do you like elite draft football at all? I got some elite draft football that uh, you know I could I could send your way. There's Barclays in those. And that yeah that. Contenders draft comes out tomorrow. Uh, personal box cost 120. Ziggy. Uh, if you get six of them, let me see what I can do for you. If you get if you get six of them at 120 a pop, uh, I could do 700. Ziggy, save you 20 bucks on that. Check out the uh, the Elite Draft Football, too, man. Very nice stuff in that. Tim, you are clearly late because I always do that at the beginning. So that's how I know you're late. Shame on you, Tim. Shame on you.
Let's go Heat. White side, where the fuck are you, man? Get in the game. Iverson was a shooting guard. Dwayne Wade was better than him, yes. Uh, why? Three championships. But Iverson has a special place in my heart. So that's, that's kind of a low blow. Goran Dragic, nice move. It's it's okay, Tim. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Sounds good, Ziggy. You know Uncle Jesse gonna take care of you. You know I got these hot hands, baby. McGrady better than Wade. Yeah, but McGrady have uh, had. His career destroyed by injuries. But if we're talking, if we're talking like no championships, head to head, I would take D Wade over Allen Iverson. Allen Iverson just has a special place in my heart. That you know, he's my favorite basketball player. But but then again, so is Dwayne Wade. Winslow with the three, baby. Keep draining those big boy. Winslow balling right now. My man getting physical. I like it. I like it, Justice. No way I lost it. Fitz, dude, I got to tell you, bro. McGrady is better than Wade when he's healthy. But uh, other than that, no. 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 McGrady was like Penny Hardaway, Grant Hill-ish. Where he had the potential to be great, and he was great for a time. And then injuries came around and was like, uh-uh. Shit, even D-Wade had, had a couple years there with the injury. You know, he missed like damn near two, three seasons straight injured. You know, one year, fresh off of winning a championship, he hurts his, his shoulder. And for like the next two years, you know, he was kind of out. So that's that's one thing people don't talk about with D Wade, but I would, dude, I would take honestly, I would take D Wade over McGrady in their prime. I would take D Wade over McGrady. You know, D Wade was a complete player, man. Is a complete player. You know, even though he's older now, my man plays defense. He can he can dish the rock. He can rebound. He can do. He can do. He can do anything except really shoot the D ball. D Wade cannot shoot the D ball. That's about it. But he can do everything else. Yeah, D Wade can't shoot. That's about it. That's about it. That's the only knock on his game is he can't. He can't really shoot the ball. But D Wade was a better passer than McGrady. A better defender. Better rebounder. But as far as scoring, yeah, Tracy McGrady probably had that. Tracy McGrady was like Kobe Bryant's biggest like competition for a while. And until you know his back gave up on him. His knees gave up on him. Now, if you want to ask me, who would I rather build my team around? Tracy McGrady or Dwayne Wade? It's Dwayne Wade every every single time. Every single time. In my opinion, a more complete player than McGrady. But McGrady could score the ball like nobody's business. Like, McGrady could put that ball in that hole from anywhere on the court. Anyways, enough talking. Let's see some action. What do we have? Good luck, everybody. 
Mighty AD. How about those Pelicans, man? Balling. Celtics been balling too. Marcus Smart to 99 for the Celtics here with the auto. Look at that. Ben Simmons just hit his free throws. Oh, shit. That's not good. Kyrie. Would have been nice to have Kyrie in the playoffs, man. Devon Reed to 189 for the Suns. Uh, who would I rather turn my team around, Ben Simmons or Donovan Mitchell? Oof. That's a tough one. That is a tough one. Right now, right now, right now, I'm going Donovan Mitchell. But in a couple years, probably, probably going to have to go uh, Ben Simmons. But in my opinion right now, you know, Donovan Mitchell's, I feel, a more complete player than uh, than Ben Simmons. Uh, what ships? Everything ships, Zenden. Uh, guys, please make sure to read the description of the listings on, on eBay, please. Uh, most of the information you are looking for, and more, more, more often than that, any questions you may have, can be answered just by reading the description of the eBay listings, folks. So please, give that a read. Reading is fundamental, people. If I couldn't read, I wouldn't be able to tell you that this is Devon Reed to 299. You know what I'm saying? I'm sure you guys read the stop sign every time you guys are driving. If you couldn't read, you know, you'd probably get into some accidents. So please, guys, make sure to read the description of the listings. But yeah, everything ships, Zenden. Everything ships. Now, it's all good, Zenden. Again, I just get a little annoyed when I hear the same question over and over and over and over again. It does get uh, does get a little annoying, so I I, I do respond with sarcasm. <laughs> Don't take it personally, Zenden. That's just that's just me, for better or worse. Uh, Seven out of ten, Dennis Smith Jr. The mighty insert. That's nice for the Mavericks. What up, Bodine? So who would you build your team around? Would you build it around Mitchell or Ben Simmons? You got the first round pick in the draft, and both are, are, are available to draft. Who are you drafting? Are you drafting Ben Simmons, or are you drafting Donovan Mitchell? You can only draft one. Five out of ten, three-color patch for Derek White of the Spurs. That's pretty nice. Let's go ahead and uh, top load that. So 189, Ananobi, Raptors, good defender right here, putting in that work. Jason Silverman is going Mitchell. I'm going to have to agree, man. But I do like to look at the long, like the, the big picture, if you will. And I think Ben Simmons has the potential to be like all-time great. Not saying that Donovan Mitchell doesn't have the same potential, but Donovan Mitchell is not seven feet tall. You know what I mean? So there, there's that. What do we have here? We got Bob Dandridge to 99. That goes to the Wizards. The Heat got the lead back. But let's go, boys. We could uh we can get that that lead a little bit bigger. Let's get it. It's getting chippy, though. It's getting chippy. I like it. I like it. That's right up our alley, baby. Luke Kennard to 199 for the Pistons. Yeah, I, I, I'm going to have to agree with you, uh, Silverman. I think Ben Simmons has potential to be like LeBron Magic Johnson great. But that man needs a jump shot desperately. To 205, he got a jump shot. Kyle Kuzma. For the Lakers. You would build your team around Bam Adebayo. Not a bad player. Bam Adebayo is a beast, man. Bam Adebayo is a beast. Watch. Bam Adebayo is going to make that that uh, that uh leap in the second year. Where people are going to be like, oh my god. How did we pass up on this guy? Look what he's doing for the Heat. Yo. Justice 
Winslow balling right now. To 25, Jordan Bell, the Warriors. Yo, Dario Saric is a really good player. I don't think he gets a. Uh, I don't think he gets enough love, man. But Dario Saric is nice, man. There you go, Warriors. Jordan Bell autograph. Mm. Dennis Smith to 299 for the Mavericks. There's Dario Saric, like I said, balling. The guy's a beast. Good timeout by the Heat right there. We need that. That man's starting to heat up. Saric's been averaging more than 20 points a game in this series. And he's, what is he, like a, a second, third-year player? Crazy. Derek White to 249 for the Spurs with a patch. What do we got? What do we got? John Collins, another nice rookie for the Hawks on card auto. What else? What else? What else? Wesley Wundu to 199 for the Magic. We got. I think there's a, still a relic in here. There it is. Give me some bacon. Dwayne Bacon to 249 for the Hornets. What else? To 299, Terrence Ferguson. Another nice rookie here. For the Thunder. Thunder in the Jazz Series, man. That's kind of crazy how Donovan Mitchell outballed three superstars last night. And a to 25 on card auto for the Raptors. People sleeping on an Anobi. Kid's a beast. Kid is a beast. Just got to work on that offense, but defensively, the kid's nasty. Solid player. Pretty much Fitz and Bodine, but, you know, what are you going to do? Good dollar to 189 for the Warriors. What else we got? The 25 Bradley Beal Wizards. You got uh, two boxes left. Each uh, stack represents a, a box. You know, I do keep them separate. Excuse me. What do we got? What do we got? Auto should be coming up here. There it is for the Spurs. Future Hall of Famer Mr. to 75, uh, Mr. Manu Ginobili. It's a good card. Kept, the, uh, kept the, the autograph all on the sticker. What a pro. What else we got? Justin Patton to 189 for the T-Wolves. What do we got? Kelly Olenek, man, has been playing really well for us all year. Nice to see him doing good in the playoffs, too. To 189, Harrison Barnes, Mavericks. Uh, I need to open up some top loaders here. 
Getting ready for 420 Eve. Make sure to leave your milk and cookies out for Snoop Dogg. <laughs> I seen that meme earlier on the uh, social medias. I thought it was funny. You know, I celebrate 420 er day. That ain't no thing. So when people are like, oh man, what are you doing for 420? Same thing I do every day. What the fuck? Like, <laughs> I'm not a fucking child. Kids do that. Oh, 420, bro. Oh my god. It was 420, 419, 418, 417, 416, 415. Amateurs. Amateurs. At a bio looks like Dwight Howard. I could see that. I need I needed I needed to get big. That's what I'm saying, Fitz. I thought I took care of that problem. You need to talk to Jason. Seriously, Fitz. You need to give him a piece of your mind, because quite honestly, I thought it's com I, th I think it's complete bullshit, Chris Fitz. You know, and I kind of talked to him about it, and you know, he was like, "Oh, you know, yo, whatever, you know, you know, I, I gave in, I was weak, I was weak." But goddamn, it might be different coming from you, Fitzy. Markel Fultz on card auto for the Sixers. That's a good card. A lot of y'all was sleeping on Markel Fultz. Oh, he can't shoot the ball. Oh, you know, oh, you know, he's going to be a bust. You know, he only played in a few games, but the potential is there, man. Kid is going to be nice. Kid is going to be nice. What else we got? Hey, out of bio. Need a little, a lighter touch on that free throw, buddy. Got to make your free throws. Justin Anderson to 199 for the Sixers. Let's go ahead and uh, T load this thing. Bad pass, boys. Turning that ball over. Damian Dotson to 299 for the Knicks. Yeah, I mean, I, I agree, Fitz. I probably should have did it. But you know me, nice guy, nice guy, Uncle Jesse. And then and then I and then I laid the band hammer down only only to have the cardboard Jesus, you know, overrule me. But, you know, again, what are you gonna do? Alright. So that is it for the break, y'all. I don't have anything to random. Uh so let's uh, go ahead and do the recap. As you all well know, we only recap the autographs. So here we go. Marco Foltz autograph for the Sixers. We got Mano Ginobili Spurs. OG Ananobi Raptors. John Collins Hawks. Jordan Bell Warriors. Bob Dandridge uh, going to the Wizards. Tyler Lydon Nuggets. And Marcus Smart for the Celtics. Not a bad break. Uh, especially if you got a hit. If you didn't get a hit, sorry. We'll get you in the next one, dope. And that was the break, y'all. 2017-18, totally certified basketball, eight-box break, number 17, eBay style. Thank you very much. We'll get that out to you.